Cross 3 here and I'm back again with a new DVD update um, for this uh, yeah but it's not really going to be a really that big update because it's only like 8 movies or something like that so uh, don't expect like a huge package or whatever uh, and uh, the reason why I haven't uploaded this video yet is because I just received uh, one of the packages today so uh, yeah, that's one of the reasons why I haven't uploaded it yet, so, uh, but uh, here we go, with the first movie. And the first one is uh, Stephen King's uh, Night Flyer. And I've been on the hunt for this movie for a pretty long time, and it's a movie that actually got some mixed reviews. I mean, I you either hate it or love it, I believe, so, um, but it seems to be really awesome and interesting. And uh, it's been out of print for a pretty long time here in Sweden as, uh, anyway, so um, yeah, The Night Flyer, really nice looking movie, it seems to be really nice. And the next one is, uh, I'm not really sure, I heard this from some kind of website, I can't really, uh, can't really remember what, the, what website it was, but some people said that this was uh, like uh, the fourth uh, violent shit movie. But uh, I don't really think that, but uh, it's directed by the same guy who made Violent Shit, and that is Nikos, the Impaler. And um, this is a limited edition, I don't really know what kind of knife they got any number or anything. I can't even see, even see that, how many uh, examples there are of these movies. But, uh, but it still says it's a limited edition up here. So, um, yeah, I'm not really sure, but like you can see here on the back. It looks pretty nasty and uh, yeah, really, really gory and all that. So, uh, but I love gory movies, so this is probably a movie for me. And uh, I've just seen some bits of violent shit as well, so uh, maybe going to pick that one up as well. Although it seems to be like pretty pathetic in my opinion, in, like all these violent shit movies. But anyway, shit the same. I got it. Nikos, Nikos, Nikos the Impaler. Sorry. And next up is this uh, that I uh, received today, and it is the Splatterama Japan box set with uh, six Splatter movies from Japan. And uh, to be honest, I've actually se seen one of these movies, uh, and that was uh, this one right here, um, Samurai Avenger The Blind Wolf. And I was hoping for a really nice movie, but I, if I remember this right, I wasn't really a, that big fan of this movie. Uh, and this is the only movie in this box set that actually has uh, English language. I mean, it's I think it's an American movie. So, uh, and it says right here that it's Kill Bill and the Seven Samurais in one movie, if you say so. And up here it says, uh, like... Like Kurosawa has been transformed into uh, Quentin Tarantino, so. But uh, I think I'll have to give this movie another chance because the first time I saw it was pretty late at night and I can't really remember that much from it. But I remember that I really didn't really like this movie that much. But yeah, Samurai Avenger Blind Wolf. And the next one is in this bloody oh, Splatterama box set is uh, this movie called Samurai Princess. Uh, and uh, like you probably already know, I love Japan, Japanese movies, and I love samurai movies, so this has to be pretty good, and yeah, you splatter all over the place probably, so yeah, samurai princess. And the next one is, uh, this looks really crazy, but still looks pretty entertaining as well, and that is uh, Robo Geisha, Geisha, I can't really pronounce it, uh, Robo Geisha, Robo whatever but it seems to be really re I mean really really crazy and violent and yeah I'm not really going to say anything else about it but yeah Robo Gesha and uh, the next one is uh, Machine Girl and uh, I don't really know, even know what to say about all these movies it's probably the same kind of thing I mean all, they're all very big with splatter and Blood and all that because it actually says on the big um, on the big uh, box set that it's prepared to fell out your umbrella because it's going to be raining blood and uh, yeah 
and there are ninjas and all that in this movie as well seems to be like uh, control no there if you see there's some ninjas and all that uh, yeah machine girl and the next one that is probably the most disturbing movie in this box set is uh, grotesque and um, I've read a little bit about it and uh, some per person says it's some kind of torture porn thing and on the front here it actually, actually says here in Swedish uh, that the hostel were pure vacation and it was just nothing compared to this movie uh, I haven't seen it but I've seen like a, tr like a trailer of it and all that it seems to be pretty nasty and all that so another disturbing movie in my collection so uh, yeah grotesque looks really cr really disgusting on there on the cover and the next one and that the probably most uh, famous or most known movie in this box set is probably this one and that is uh, Tokyo Gore Police it seems to be really crazy and awesome as well and this movie is the movie that I probably am most looking forward to see uh, because um, I don't really know why but I know very many people are still talking, talking about these movies that like splatter movies and all that so it still seems to be crazy and awesome and all that so yeah Tokyo Gore please and like you can see on the cover art I mean you've probably seen it before but it looks crazy sorry for reflex reflections by the way but you can see it right here all crazy up here and yeah whatever it looks very nasty so thank you very much for watching and I hope you didn't get bored and uh, the next video is probably going to be uh, like a review video of all the Crow movies because I promised uh, Marco the movie fan that I would make a review video of all the Crow movies so uh, yeah check out check out this link I will put this link down below in the description he's a really nice guy and subscribe to him and yeah like his videos and all that so yeah that was everything that I wanted to say in this video and I hope you enjoyed and uh, I hope to see you again as soon as possible so see you next time bye bye